the Chemistry Caucus of the House of Representatives identify with government and people of Cape State over the recent flood disaster. We, the Cape State Caucus of the House of Representatives, commensurate with government and people of Cape State over the flood disaster that abate the entire state, being the focal point of the federal government policy for rice production in the country. The disaster could not have come at a worse time for our farmers who hitherto look, for, look forward to a bumper harvest this year to reduce the rising cost of food items. It is a major setback to the federal government effort to boost local rice production as part of measures to end rice importation. The flood is a serious setback towards addressing food security in the country. The government therefore needs to address the shortfall of the food supply chain to reduce the hardship and the cost of food items in the market and also address the severe environmental degradation caused by the flood. This may include adequate and early preparation for dry season farming and the reconstructions of major infrastructure affected in the state. The members of this caucus commend the, Mr. President and Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Muhammad Buhari, GCFR, and the Executive Governor of Kebbi State, Senator, His Excellency, Senator Abakara Atiku Bagudu, for the prompt response to reduce the hardship caused by the flood. The, estim the estimated cost of the disaster is over 10 billion naira across the state. We call on the federal government as a matter of urgency to send relief materials to alleviate the suffering of the people in the state. Early preparation for dry season farming should commence in earnest with prohibitions of seedlings, fertilizer, and other, and other inputs to be made available to the farmers in good time. Finally, we call on the government to commission a study with the aim of prevailing a lasting solution to the perennial flood disaster in the state. It is our pleasure to brief the press on this our position so that the hardship being experienced by our people across the state will be reduced. All the eight members of the House of Representatives endorse this opposition and they are solidly they are solidly behind this. They should have brought us here in the situation in our own state. The current now now the transportation and communication between various groups is not even possible now. This morning, His Excellency the Governor of the State is in my local government because the bridge connecting more than two sides. No, north and south of the country. North and south of the country. Jaga. At Jega is about to collapse. collapse. It is the entire state is involved. And you can imagine when over ten billion is lost, most of their livelihood is lost. So that is serious concern. This is what the members are telling the whole world. And we are going to stage and take part on what we believe will reduce this hardship. Uh, we mentioned that this material time, the farmers are expecting 
vampire based because they have estimated that before now they should have started harvesting before the coming of the rain, before the coming of the flood. So because, because of the timing, this is not what they expect at this material time. Normally the flood will start towards the end of this September. This calculation is done. That's why we said uh, the government should commission a study. So they will advise the farmers at what time they should be able to start cultivation. And when they cultivate at this time, so, so, by a social period, they should be harvesting before the flood comes. So this is very clear. Maybe I'm just for two years old, but I have never seen this in KB. And all my life has stayed in KB. This is almost one out of almost 50 years. When you see from the valley of uh, Argungu down to close to Benin Republic, all that area is submerged by flooding. This is quite different. That's why we are trying to call the federal government to, quest to a commission a, a study on this what caused this problem. What is the problem? If this is climate change, what can we do about it? Flooding and any serious disaster is in the residual list of the state, mm -hmm. which is preserved for the state to do something. And but don't forget, the President Muhammad, of, uh, President Muhammad of Buhari is a president for everybody. And he, among other things, his policy on rice production, this issue is centers on rice production. His major policy on rice production that warrant him to close border, to force farmers, more especially in KB and other parts of the country, to produce rice, for the country. to avoid mm -hmm. importation of rice. This is centered. That's why I'm bringing up for the issue of the federal government should come in because of the agitation we have and the policy of the federal government. Thank you very much. People really want to succeed. In addition, 